come one, come all, to the Mario Ball. We are going to be beginning a playthrough of a very Super Mario World. What a nice title for a hack. I love it. So, this is by Schwermutter on Super Mario Central, of course. And, um, yeah, so he says, Thanks for downloading a very Super Mario World and giving it a try. It's a hack that has been in development for way too long, five years, and was developed to induce feelings of classic Mario platforming with a lot of twists. This hack will start out easy and gradually get harder as it goes on, but never too difficult. At about 120 exits long, the hack is rather expansive and has plenty of secrets and references to get. Sounds good to me. Uh, let's dive in, shall we? I did start a file just to see if it's all working, but yeah. Uh, have not gone into Yoshi's house or anything of the likes. Let's see what he has to say. Alright. Same as it ever was. You know, I have to admit, it's been a long time since I have played a mainline Mario game. Probably a couple months at most. <laughs> it's still a long time. Um, welcome to the ever-changing dinosaur land. The object is simple. Simply reach the goal post to finish a level. Good luck. Well, thanks, dude. I'll try my best. Oh. Could have gone wrong there, but... Problems solve themselves. There is no satisfying row of Koopas to destroy with their own shell, which is too bad. Because I appreciate that satisfying feeling. But hey, it does not have to be a one-to-one -one replica. In fact, I'm sure they're trying to avoid that. Chuck! Be gone! I'd like to eradicate this shell, but it might be a little bit above my pay grade at the moment. I had to drop off a friend at work early, so <laughs> I woke up a little earlier than usual. Might not be in my best state of mind. Anyways, Yoshi says, Thank you, Mario. Bowser trapped me in that egg while I was saving my friends. We have to help them. Ooh, that's different. Yoshi, are you conspiring with Chuck? Because the evidence points to yes. You led that. You led that boy right on top of me. What have you to say for yourself? Nothing. He's just a mute little dinosaur. That's fine. Everyone expresses themselves in unique ways. Will he ever come back? He has. If you love him, let him go. Ooh! Oh, whoa. What's this? Hey, are there uh, dragon coins in this hack? Perhaps? There are. Interesting. <laughs> Watch your step! <laughs> Watch your head! Stuck in the middle with Blue Koopa. Wish you could eat a Chuck, wouldn't that be nice? That would feed Yoshi for at least five minutes. Freaking gluttonous boy. Very, very hungry. Yoshi don't like meatballs! In this case, the meatball is our old friend Charles here. Okay, they... Alright, that's a good that's a good invincibility star to show off, because it looks like there is a shorter duration for the invulnerability, compared to Super Mario World's extremely generous time. Fancy that, huh? Alright. Grass Garrison 1, that's what that level was called. Probably should be acknowledging that. And this one... Oh, they have subtitles too. Timber in the Sky. Excellent. Let's continue. I like it. Very smooth feeling. The next level is an aesthetic... <laughs> aesthetic athletic level. Sorry. I didn't get a single life in the previous stage? That's unfortunate. Was there a single mushroom here? My, uh, short-term memory is not the greatest. Oh, Shrombosis. Deliver your fleshy protuberances unto me. Feast your fungus. Well, 
the donut blocks are a little bit quicker on the trigger than I was anticipating as well. Hey, the more you know. It's my excuse for dying. Won't hold up much longer. Because <laughs> I get to know these things. Practice yields the results. Experimentation is key. Why do I even try for the freaking Yoshi coins? Don't need them. They're not indicated on the map. Even if they were, I'd probably be, uh, be too lazy of a boy to collect them all. Never did it in the original Super Mario World. I did do it in New Super Mario Bros. for the Nintendo DS. And New Super Mario Bros. 2 for the Nintendo 3DS. That was just lazy on my part. I apologize for that cringe-inducing maneuver. Oh, look at that. But yeah, those are the only two Mario games that I have 100% completed. Nothing... What the heck is with this music block? What? What? That music block was not tinted red. It is not... E block? E? What is this, Mega Man? <laughs> These are solid blocks. And, um... Well... They're not solid blocks. Scratch that. Oh, I get a feather for this. Well, thank you. Oh, E, maybe that means entities only? Implying Mario is not a valid entity? <laughs> I don't know. Let's get out of here, dude. That cleared the level. Okay. I suppose there's no secret exit there. It is not a red level. Carry on, then. Mm, what have we here? Grass Garrison 3, the M and E blocks. Okay, so now we'll have a formal introduction. Should go back and finish that level, maybe? But I guess not, because there's no secret exit. So, I guess that's it then. Blocks with a big M on them are solid only to Mario. E blocks are solid to everything else. Don't forget this. I figured that out by experimentation, but thank you for officializing it. Notarized. Ooh. Burrito Bob in the house. Fortunately, I am armed and ready. I will keep it safe. Hmm, Senor Koopa? Don't think you can launch an offensive against me, no? These are some very, very, very relatively harmless bullet cannons. I'm receptive to this. Oh, that's an exit pipe. Okay. I welcome it with open arms. Large smile. Diplomatic immunity. That? Wow. You know, I thought Isaac... <laughs> okay, so what I've been playing for the past multiple months is The Binding of Isaac, you see. And that game has a lot of decisions in it, you know? Take items to make combinations. Some are good, some are fatal. And, um, you know, I thought I'd be exempt from such brain activity in this game. But that's not the case. I freaking annihilated my cape. I have to be strategic with my items. Rest in peace, cape. Well, I'll just say that it's, it was meant to be. It's a little too overpowered, right? Oh, hey, brick blocks. Fancy that. And they turn into question mark blocks. Well, an attempt was made. <laughs> Could have been implemented a little better, but it is the thoughts that counts. Just the sheer presence of having brick blocks is quite nice. Really diversifies the whole- oh! Entity blocks. Ah, Shellatorium. Ooh! Key zone? Wait, the freaking brown bricks don't get converted? Excuse me? Hey, where's that key, friend? Come on, Charlie. You can do better than that. There we go. Deceased. Where is that key, friends? Where could it be? Okay, that's a flower. That's nice. Key? Key, please? Key? 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 Anyone? Anywhere? In my hair? Oh, where, oh, where could that nice big old key be? I'm backtracking all the way. In the vain hopes that we find a key, it's probably in these pipes. Over here. Over yonder. Not over here. Not over there. Maybe this one. No? That was a piranha plant, wasn't it? Doesn't exempt it, mind you. 
My oh my, where could it be? Searching desperately, searching for a key. Now is it in one of those? God forbid. Well, if I had the Yoshster, it would be a lot more practical to check those out. But as it stands, I do not have the Yoshster. Jeez, buddy! <laughs> Could you... Wow, he single-handedly dismantled all my power-ups. Alright, well, that key, as far as I can tell, it's gonna be a fun thing to find. Oh, yes it will. Oh, yes it will. <laughs> Sorry, there's some freaking Discord pings going on. Very unprofessional. Just gotta ignore that. Um, streamer mode is enabled, but the sound effects persist. Kind of silly, huh? Well, anyways, um, I feel like it's worth a shot to investigate this a little bit further, so prepare yourself. This might take a while. I should probably... You know what? Let's go. Go back, grab a feather. Mario, you can work a little faster. Just kidding, I know it's unfeasible, but still. Did you see that? That's the kind of professional stuff we're going to have to hold on to for the remainder of this playthrough. Remember this now. Oh, standard Goombas. That's another nice quality of life. Okay. Just go ahead and dodge my shell, would you? Like, pardon me, sir. I don't freaking weird team. If you're ever feeling down, it, it's probably best to not um, do a blind jump there. Hey, there's a pipe here. What in tarnation is this, huh? It's a scary jump, but a, a doable one. What, what are you fine folks doing here? This little pipe freaking pipe party. Pipe party, let's go. One by one, the piranha plants will emerge. I'm glad that they re perfectly replicated how inaccurate piranha plants are. Okay, there's my Yoshi. So, oh right, I brought my Yoshi in last time, didn't I? Yes. I think so, at least. So there's that exit pipe that I was referring to. There's our midpoints that's not really necessary, but we gained a life. Never mind, we did not gain a life. <laughs> you can fall off that bridge. That's really insidious. Good. Now demonstrate knowledge. Oh, that's not something you can pass through. Well, let's just uh, go on ahead then. We will have no cape. We will try it out without a cape. Goodness gracious. Hi, Bob. There's a shrimp. There's gotta be something to the right. I need my cape feather. So it looks like we're backtracking. Once again. There's not really any feasible life farm, is there? Where could my pipe be? Garfield! Say, where am I? I don't think I ever reached this point previously. This is the correct exit, okay. Well. I cannot move springs. Good to know. Good to know. Now, it did say hack difficulty hard on the tin. But I didn't expect something so crafty to happen this early on in the game, you know? Hiding a feather in a hard to reach place? Allowable. But, uh, <laughs> this is just nuts, huh? This is insane. Um, considering you almost certainly need it for that key. We've reached the end of the level. How is it some 
quasi-quantum entangled portal zone that only m manifests once I've reached the end of the level. Only manifests when uh, directly observed. A small cognito hazard that uh, erases its perception until you reach nearby. Kinda makes me lose focus on the lower... Yoshi! We had some good times. Love's got me going so crazy right now. Oh, now I'm at the midpoint. Okay. Sail over his freaking encapsulated carapace. What a horrible, horrible creature. I remember regressing past... Ah, there it is. See? <laughs> Blast off. I necesito blastir. <laughs> Just an inside joke amongst my friends. Uh, you know Jimmy Neutron, his catchphrase? Got a blast! Well, translate that into butchered Spanish and you've got some, you've got some grade A humor going on. There is our prize of the honor. That's right, we have the feather. Don't want to get freaking killed by the auto scroll here, okay? Alright, Yoshi, you and me, man. We are off to achieve great things. That has to be a Star World warp, doesn't it? I mean, just look. Right, I don't have Yoshi. The midpoint was saved? That is the grandest thing I've ever heard. Hey, you know that idea I had earlier about the cape? Well, it looks like it was false. Take two. Keep the cape this time, don't override it. Would be a very, very poor choice. Smash every brick block! Leave no stone unturned. Toil through all the soil till your brain's been churned. What, this crevice. Does it mean anything? I'm reaching here, that can't possibly mean anything. What could possibly go wrong? This is it, this is it. Spending the past 15 minutes looking for this one key. Punting Chuck! I will punt you into oblivion, be gone. With my cape, that is. <laughs> one Yoshi coin, yay for me. Mario's all-powerful cape. Oh. Wait, did I get that last time? I do believe so. I can touch that. You're joking, right? Enemy off-screen. XCOM 2, enemy off-screen. <laughs> no, no. Okay, I did find the vine last time. There's our silver P. There's our keyhole. This raises many questions. Alright. Entity block. Mario block. I forgot. Mario block only blocks Mario. Yes. That much should be obvious. Well, let's reverse back to our... Alright, there's, there's fully covered ground here. No risk of kick death. Um, Mario on suicide watch. I can't even satisfactorily bump these. That's too bad. Chuck. Don't appreciate your existence. And that's the goal. Alright. Here's the deal. We're going to pretend that secret exit doesn't exist, alright? And we will move on. We will backtrack eventually. But until then. <laughs> Mushroom! I just need you now Cause you are beautiful in every single way Words can't bring me down Whoa, 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 whoa 
that water, or these stone blocks, go a little too low. Do you understand what I am saying? This level has no secret exit. Take it easy, take it easy. Get through it nice and quick. Please, boss! Spin jump on the man. Perfect. Wah! -ha. Perfect! Oh, no! Oh, God! Help! Ooh, this is unsettling. I noticed that there is, uh, no, no layer 3, um, visuals. A tad unfortunate, but then again, it is a relatively advanced maneuver. Hey, what the heck? That was a strange little glitched interaction, wasn't it? Oh, I need to be big to get in there, huh? I gotta be big, huh? I think you're the bigger guy, huh? Hey, at least the porky puffer is long gone. Oh, it's just a shortcut, okay. How do I get a tasty item? <laughs> Mushroom. More like that, please. Please, no obscure secret exits. <gasps> Rise. The hill has ascended. The hill has eyes. Koopa Kid Castle number one, Iggy Koopa. Hey. I forgot the subtitles. Tidal Trouble, great. Not really a tide level, though. It's a layer two level with water. The M and E blocks. Hmm. The only interaction I saw there was the 1-Up Mushroom and his Silver Pea Switch. We might as well wrap up this aspect of the world, at least. This is the new Super Mario Brothers Castle theme. Sign me up. I like this instrumentation. Translates relatively well to the, uh, Super Famicom. Spew your fireballs everywhere. I'm sorry, I'm busy listening to the music. What if I don't want to spew a fireball? Pacifist Mario. Excuse me, who dares disturb me at my time of work? There we go. More fire? Sure, why not? Oh, dry bones. And bones. Ah! 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 Whoa, Koopa, did you get decapitated? I'm sorry. Is Mario's bomb that powerful? Does it impel such, such a force that your entire head gets severed from your body? That's freaking brutal, dude. Brutal Mario. Ah! Right in the kisser. That's not a boss door. I shouldn't be scanning for a power up there. There's the boss door. Oh, this is back in the first section. That's clever. I mean, the power up was explicitly available to us, so. No need to look for a hidden block. What the? Oh, it's Koopaling Iggy from Mario 3-ish zone. He moves very deliberately. It's quite unsettling. Iggy, my man. Saunter towards my direction. Four dragon coins I've gotten. Sir! Hammers! Hammers! You have the audacity to bring such metal contraptions into this boss fight. Fight me 1v1, no weapons, please. Okay, well this time I won't lose my hit instantly. <laughs> That's the goal, at least. Baby steps. Baby steps. If they put a hidden 1-up mushroom in front of the boss door, I would be appreciative. I would receive that 
with a warm welcome. He follows the freaking Red Koopa AI to an extent. Just gotta freaking speed run his bum. Bum rush that boy. 269 seconds on the clock. Fastest man this side of the Mississippi. Mississippi River! What's that? Mario, if you don't know where the Mississippi is, how would you know that it's a river? Ah! You got to me! Mario has defeated the estranged, estranged Iggy Koopa in castle number one and has rescued one of Yoshi's friends. The peaceful Padlock Plains awaits Mario on the next step of his journey. And that is where we will resume next time. Perhaps I will look for that secret exit off camera, but until then, thanks for watching, leave a like, subscribe to get some more awesome Super Mario World Central content, and I will see you next time.